Well, we're down on Company Street and we're gonna spend the morning here with Don Sawyer. And he's gonna give us a little art lesson. Morning, Jack. Good morning, Don. How are you doing this morning? Beautiful morning to be painting outside, isn't it? It is. Doing a little, uh, little Hollywood fish, fish with a, a little bit of country street on it. I think it's important to uh, uh, for the art community in this part of the world to find to to uh, get familiar with Company Street, because I believe that the Company Street will become famous. If it's not already famous. It needs to be. We need artists down here to uh, help make that happen. Nothing will do it quicker than art will. Yeah. And, uh, I've always been, ever since I got here, I've been committed to uh, helping at least in uh, promoting the arts in Wetumpka. And now, uh, on Company Street, it's a great name, like Royal or Charters or Chartres, or how do you pronounce that in New Orleans? I got you. I Julia got you. or Bill in Memphis. Julia in New Orleans in the warehouse garden business. It can, it can happen. Get you right down there with the artist. See every brush stroke. Yeah, I might switch to a knife in a minute. There you go. Trying to create some contrast here right now and just figure out exactly where I'm going with these colors. This orange playing off that turquoise is a good deal. It may not stay that way though. I may change it later. The paint will tell me what to do. It's coming right along. All right, we'll check back with you in a few minutes, Don. Thank, Thank you, Jack. We have a couple of people watch it. Okay, Don, tell me about that fish hanging up in there. In the, in that was shop. an advertisement for a particular lure. You don't want the one hanging from the ceiling? Yeah, yeah. For a particular lure in a bait shop. And it was hanging from the ceiling in the bait shop. And I talked him out of it. Uh -huh. And uh, painted it hanging my, in my gallery. Started out down in, down in Destin. It's been all over. It is part of the family. That's kind of unique. Yeah. Coming right along, got a little blue sky there. Yeah, I, I, I like this contrast and this. Yeah. This. Uh, this is really a cool concept. I got a, a background laid in. I did it last night of raw umber. Coming over the top of it with this blue and white. which is complimentary to the, to the raw umber. Complimentary means that it's, a, it's an opposite color. Yeah, I like that. Some people do, some people don't. I've, I've got to have uh, contrast. I've got to have color and I've got to have contrast in my world.
These are uh, gifts for the two newest businesses on Company Street. One, uh, Company Street Mercantile, which is down there, and then uh, Poppy Lane. Jana's gonna take those down there and just give them to them. And that, it gives them a, a housewarming gift, so to speak, and it also promotes Company Street. There you and go. Gets the Hollywood fish in there too with that grin. We want people smiling. Yep. We want them coming to Company Street for everything. We've got everything you need right here on Company Street. Some of the most gorgeous gifts, clothes. Johnny Oaks down there with his world famous coffee and uh, the Hollywood fish. So there we go. Good deal. Out. And we hope they like them. I'm sure they will. They're going to be some real successful here. Crystal Bell just moved over here. It's got me straight from uh, Bridge Street down there. And they have, they're just a wonderful shop. I bought Christmas gifts in there for, for people. And uh, they're new to come. The company street is full now. There's not a single store available. Everything on this street is completely rented. Uh, but if an artist could get in here anywhere, I highly recommend that some of these young artists around here in Old Woods too start taking a hard look at Country Street because the day will come when you won't be able to rent here. You won't be able to get in here. It's going to be another small version of Royal or some of the more famous streets in, in the country. It needs to be all art. Country Street needs to be art. There needs to be art in every store, regardless of what that store is selling, and uh, that's something we'll talk about. Talk about at another time, but uh, I believe art is very important to a community, and I know it is, in fact. Just because what it's done here. contrast in there. Yeah. So there should be a Hollywood fish in every store on this street. And if there's not, let's make sure we put one in there, Jana. Okay. <clears throat> well, it's coming along. I'm not had decided whether I'll uh, stop with this first layer or not. Sometimes I do. This is a a technique. Notice the way I'm holding this brush. I'm holding the brush like a knife, which gives it a a uh, somewhat of a crude. That's not the right word. Primitive look. And that's what I'm after. Uh, I don't believe in staying in the lines. Or it should be about, uh, it should be about imagination. Necessarily accuracy, that's the way I am, but I, uh, so I say that I got a lot of friends that are that are uh, photorealistic artists and I love them, I just don't think that way. 
Everybody has their own style, Don. Yeah. I want to emphasize something. If there are any artists watching this, Trump to come to the street. If you want to paint, you want to paint outside, even if you don't have a gallery here, come see me. And we can arrange it. I'd love to have you. You're welcome to come paint with me on Saturdays. Uh, and come get some exposure and show this town and uh, uh, the surrounding towns that we're gonna be an art center here. We're gonna be a cultural art center. And I'm talking about Company Street, Wetumpka, Alabama. It can happen. Y'all don't, don't get lost in there now. <laughs> <laughs> I think we all fit in there. I'm just playing now, just adding a little bit of, just messing with it. Give it a little bit of movement. until the painting says stop. There is no, I get a question all the time, how do you know when a painting's finished? Only the painting knows that. Artists can't tell when it's finished. No way, because it can always, you can always add another stroke. But the painting will tell you, Saturday with Sawyer, down on Company Street. Land with color. They're getting real serious now. Absolutely. There's no such thing as serious down here. <laughs> I mean, you see my big fancy gallery, don't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll give I got the best assistant in the world right there. Yes, sir. Dana? Yeah. Great. I love that palette you're painting with there. Where do you... Is that the Charmin box? No. I got that from Bob Ross. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Ah, okay. So you better, better tell them that you've been calling me Bob Ross. <laughs> no, I haven't really. I called him Bob once, but it had nothing to do with Bob Ross. I don't know. That's kind of a happy... Happy fish. Yeah. Happy little fish. <laughs> Hollywood fish stands for... A positive attitude, anything good. Uh, and successful. And patriotic. And happy. But primarily it's designed to put a smile on your face. And it'll do it. Hard to look at it and not grin. 
that was accidental. God did it. I didn't do it. Well, we're about to finish up with Don Sawyer and his art demonstration this morning. You want me to sign it just for you, Jack? Abs oh, absolutely. Let me see you sign it. Oh! Sawyer Ross. Sawyer Ross. <laughs> Little inside joke. There you go. The, fin the finished product for the most part. He might add a little stroke or two. Uh, he's, he could be. He probably is finished, actually. And I, I've got time to spare here, so I might just do another one. All right. Well, Don. So what what have you got to say about all this? Thank God for the opportunity to uh, to make art and. Uh, Maybe put a smile on somebody's face. All right, thank you so much for sharing with us this morning, Don. Thank you, Jack. If you like this video, hit the like button. Also, hit the subscribe button as well. It really helps out the channel. Thank you so much for watching.